How to be a PNG tuber on mobile has been the most commonly asked question for the past few years. And sadly, there was no real known way of doing it until today. Links for everything that's talked about in today's video will be in the description down below. The first thing we gotta do is head to the App Store on our iPhone or our Play Store on our Android device. You then wanna hit the like and subscribe button on this video so other VTubers like yourself can find content just like this. The next thing we want to do is search for an app called Prism Live. Once the app is downloaded and installed, we want to open the app. With the app open, most of you are going to want to log in with Twitch so it's easier for you to stream. Make sure you click allow on all the pop-ups that show up on the app. In the bottom middle, we want to change the camera tab to VTuber. We then want to click on the gear icon on the right hand side and then swipe all the way to the right until we see the option to upload our own avatar. Now you can use the avatars that are provided by the app, but I know most of you will have your own already. You then wanna click on each image that associates to each emotion. I do suggest that all your images are in a PNG format, so it allows proper transparency. Now that our avatar is set up, let's check out some settings and features of the app. On the left-hand side of the screen, we have a slider adjuster for our microphone, so we can change the sensitivity of it. On the right hand side of the screen, underneath the gear icon, we have a button that gives us the ability to change our background. Prism also gives us the ability to use a green screen, which is fantastic if we want to use it on websites like GoLightStream or maybe edited YouTube content. On the top right hand side, if we click our profile image, we can click on the gear icon and that will give us more options like stream destinations. So we don't have to stream just to only Twitch, we can stream to YouTube, Facebook and other sites. We also have other settings like video resolution, resolution, and even bit rate. But we are not quite done just yet. If we swipe right, we see that we have the ability to add widgets. So Prism Chat, RTMP video source, web sources like stream elements. We also have the ability to add titles, screen savers, clock timers, and even social media. If we click cancel real quick to get rid of that, you see we can also add video playlists, music playlists, and we have the ability to play with media itself. So videos, photos, and playing music directly from our phone. Now that we're satisfied with all the settings and the setup, all we gotta do is hit the ready button, select our destination, and just like that, we are now live as a PNG tuber on mobile using Prism. Thank you so much to Prism for making PNG tubing so easy on mobile. This is fantastic software, I highly suggest anybody and everybody download the software right now and give it a try again i'm your vtuber senpai i stream here on youtube every friday 5 p.m pacific standard time so come on by say hi let's talk about anime gaming vtubing whatever and well i'll catch you all the next one bye